All right, now it is time to look at the inventory. So on a touch screen, the inventory is down here, the three dots next to what is called your hot bar. And this is kind of like your pockets. So you have these nine slots and whatever you have in these slots is actually what you can hold and use. So if you click on the three dots, you get to your inventory screen. And the way this looks is it shows your character. You can actually have armor on the right side. This is a crafting table, perfect for crafting items if you're playing in survival mode. And then if you click above that, that shows you uh, what I call is 27 slots. You see it's a three by nine. Uh, this is more of like your backpack. So you could actually put things in here so you don't have to search in the inventory to find it, but it's not readily available. You would have to go back to the inventory and just pull this up, but at least you wouldn't have to search it again. So I'm actually going to go to the far left. I clicked on the search and you can actually search for anything. So if I want to search for wood, it's going to pull up everything that's made of wood and then it allows me to touch. And then as soon as I touch it, I can touch any of my spots and it'll put it there. Don't worry about the number 64. When you're in the creative mode, it's going to say 64. It means you have unlimited. So it's not like you only have 64 wood pieces there. And let's say I add this other one. So touch once on the screen where you want to have the objects and then touch in the actual hot bar. If you want to um, move any items to different areas, for instance, if I want to, uh, Notice it, it makes it really just full screen rather than not earlier. So it's that's why on the right side, I just kind of keep that open so I can see everything. So there's not as much scrolling, but you can see there's nature. So nature items, and anytime you see a plus, it just means there's more varieties of that. So you really can't take it uh, any item from the plus or the minus, but the one right after it, you can just touch and then send on down to your area there. Uh, if you go to the items, you can see all the different items you have. So you can have fire, there's different color houses, or excuse me, beds. You have beacons, you have all sorts of mob, um, mob heads and things like that. You have diamonds, let me add the diamond. I can go to equipment, and this is just going to show you the different types of equipment you have, from leads to compasses to maps to all different types of potions, fishing rod there. I have all sorts of food items I can grab. Let's grab the cake. Um, and then this equipment, which also could be used to put on your armor. And then last is construction materials. So you have all sorts of construction materials, including all of these elements, which is used for um, lots of chemistry that can be done inside of Minecraft. But there's cool things like this terracotta, glazed terracotta. So it allows you to have kind of more than just plain blocks. They have some, some color to them. And really that's, um, that's what you have as far as your inventory. So you can search and look for all those, remember, um, just depending on what you put in here. You can even type in colors. So if you say, oh, I just need something red, it'll bring up all the things that have the word red in it. So there's red standstone, there's uh, red banners, all sorts of stuff. Now, if I wanna move some of this stuff around or maybe move it kind of into that chest or I call it a backpack, but it's really this chest, I can put the cake in there or I can touch and hold and notice the green line went there. And now if I touch down here, it puts a portion of them. So I can have some saved in there and some up top. So um, really it, it, it does not matter. Um, but if you wanna move things and move items in and out, you could easily do that. Now to get back to the game. Oh, let me grab some grass because we wanna fill in that spot. So I'll just type in grass and then move it to slot number one. And that's it. That's how you take care and, um, and grab items for your inventory. If you need to move slots or you decide later you want something to go to a different slot, just back to your three dots. You can touch the item and then touch the next spot and it just moves it. So you can easily just add things and fill up all your spots. Once you have no more spots, you'd have to replace. 
So if I wanted to say, well, wait a second, I want to add this, um, let's go here. Let's add this jukebox or whatever. I'd have to pick an area and it replaces that. Now, where did it go? It's totally gone. So when you replace it, it moves out unless you were to move it back into this chest. Click on the X or touch the X. And now you're back to your world and you're able to use those items that you put in your hot bar below. In each hotbar, the way you actually use the items is you select what item you want to use, and it will allow you to do things with that specific item. And you'll see you're holding it in the right 